Hello Aquarius! Welcome back to the Sarkar Tarot. We're going to go ahead and get you guys some messages from Spirit and then we'll get into your reading. If you're here, welcome, welcome to all my returning subscribers. Mwah! You know I love you. If you're here, do me a favor. Thumbs up this video. Subscribe. If you are still trying to decide if you're going to subscribe, please do. We would love to have you. Spirit is saying have faith, Aquarius. So somebody needs to trust in their situation. Trust your faith in their situation is what Spirit just pulled up here, okay? All right. Yes, like I was saying, we would love to have you guys definitely hit that subscribe button. Remember that YouTube has turned off everybody's notifications. So if you're not receiving notifications from any of your favorite people that you want to, please remember to go into your settings, click notifications, and toggle that button back on, okay? All right, Aquarius, what's going on, Spirit? What messages do you have for Aquarius? Aquarius, they already mentioned in faith, honey, that is a part of you, okay? So make sure that if it's something that you need to give to God, please give it to God because it's going to be taken care of is what I'm hearing. What messages, Spirit, do you have for my Aquarius? What messages do you have for my Aquarius? What messages do you have for my Aquarius? Oh, these are two nice cards that have popped up here. Thank you. I'm going to put that right there. You know what? I'm going to put it down here so we can try to keep as many cards off the table. Listen with your heart. Aquarius, you are listening, but you need to hear with a loving heart. Spirit is saying for some of you guys, you could be born on the 1st, some on the 20th, and you also have I love you. These are powerful words. So, Spirit is wanting you guys to know that you're definitely razzling and dazzling of Aquarius. They love you deeply, okay? They want you to continue to listen with your heart. Lead with your heart. Remember, God is love, guys. What additional messages do you have for Aquarius, Spirit? Thank you for your blessings. Thank you for protecting me and my viewers. Thank you for your guidance, your discernment, and your security. Thank you for providing us with white, bright light. What messages do you have for Aquarius? What messages do you have for Aquarius? You have sun. What messages do you have for Aquarius? Your sun is watched over and protected as he explores this world. Some of y'all might have a son, a teenage son, okay, or an older son that you worry about Aquarius. Spirit wants you to definitely know that your son is being watched over. So this could be something that you've been praying about. And Spirit giving you the okay that you don't need to worry about your son. He's definitely being watched over and they are protecting him. He's just exploring the world. He has to go through his own thing. You've got the power, Spirit says. Use your abilities, Aquarius, to resolve any issue that you have. You can do it is what they're saying to you. And you also have flower power. So Spirit is saying for you guys need to spend some time with flowers. And either you need to plant some. And flower essences, this is actually going to increase your personal healing power, Aquarius, is what Spirit is saying, okay? All right, let's see. We're going to put these over to the side because at the end of the day, it's... Let's see what the situation surrounds you. Alright, so what's going on with my Aquarius? What's going on with my Aquarius? What's the situation surrounding the Aquarius? What messages, Spirit, do you have for our Aquarius? What messages do you have for Aquarius? What's the situation? What do they need to be concerned about? What messages? Reciprocity. I want to have an equal give and take. All right, Aquarius. Somebody is thinking about reciprocity with you. That call comes out often. Somebody be having y'all on their mind because I believe that was a y'all last reading. The situation. Reciprocity. Somebody definitely wants to come back. I feel like Aquarius. Somebody feel like they're not experiencing what they was experiencing when they was with you. What messages, Spirit, do you have for Aquarius? We're going to see if it pops back out. But that's just a little side. They told me to put it back. What messages do you have for Aquarius? Let's see, you got soul ties. Somebody got y'all in their damn mind and they wrecking their brains. I can't even only shuffle the fucking cards. They're wrecking your brains over you, Aquarius. What messages, Spirit, do you have for Aquarius? 
too. Child is really stressing out about y'all, Aquarius. What's going on here? What's going on, Spirit? What's going on for my Aquarius? Absence. I told you. Somebody feeling you, you're gone, Aquarius. Somebody is feeling that you've left. I feel like a part of me is missing without you, Aquarius. I'm telling you, absence come right on up out here. I tell y'all, somebody feel like what the fucking the, the, the apple they biting off right now, the child, it don't taste good. What's going on, spirit? What's going on? What's going on with my office? Chemistry. Somebody, I'm telling you. Let me get the rest of the cards up, child. Spirit, unfinished business, child. <laughs> Dishonesty. Spirit, say, runner. Somebody feel like you running from them Aquarius girl with the sneak. Probably because there's somebody that used to charm you back in the past, or this person used to charm you before you let their ass go. Okay. This person was hoping that you was going to enable the ass and you didn't clear. You set up boundaries and left them right in the back. Shall they always doing this? And then later on will come with the bullshit. Aquarius, somebody is feeling your absence. Like I said, thank you, Spirit, for the confirmation all the time. Okay, somebody that used to have chemistry with you or you had chemistry with them. Somebody feels like they never felt a passion that intense with you, Aquarius. Okay, this person it has unfinished business with you, or at least they believe in their heart that they do. Somebody believes that um you guys still have things that you need to resolve and discuss. This could have been somebody that was dishonest with you by lying. They feel like they definitely ripped y'all apart, Aquarius. And this person feels like you are now on the run away from the ass, Aquarius. That you do not want them anymore. You don't want to deal with them. Okay. This person is <sighs> so the reminiscent. Okay, so that's why reciprocity probably come out as the first card. They give it right there. Okay, this is somebody that definitely wants some type of give and take with you again, Aquarius. Let me get these cool. No. Okay, Spirit, I got you. All right, y'all. Let me see. All right, Spirit, thank you for your guidance and your support. What messages do you have for Aquarius? What messages do you have for Aquarius? Aquarius, Aquarius. What messages do you have for my Aquarius? What messages do you have for my Aquarius? What messages do you have for Aquarius? Thank you, thank you, thank you, Spirit. Messages. What messages do you have for Aquarius? Spirit, what's this absence about? Oh, the Knight of Cups, somebody. <laughs> I mean to laugh, y'all. But this person is absent. I'm feeling your absence, Aquarius, because this is somebody that used to be chivalrous with you. Somebody that used to be romantic with you. Somebody felt that you was a deep communicator. What's chemistry? We're going to see though, okay? What's chemistry? Mm -hmm. The five of cups. Somebody feel like whatever y'all had has died out of Aquarius or they weren't able to keep it. It was intense, but it wasn't something that they was able to hold on when it came down to you, Aquarius. What's unfinished business, Spirit? What's unfinished business? What is unfinished business? The hermit. Mm -hmm. They over there wrecking their mind, breaking their brains about you. What's the dishonesty? What's the dishonesty? The four of wands. This could have been somebody you've been living with, Aquarius, or y'all been talking about living with each other. Because the four of wands here, somebody ruined something with lies. Child, please. What's the runner? What's the runner? The runner is the two of coins, but it, it came out in the reverse. This person is hoping that you change your mind, honey. Okay? Bottom of the deck with the girl. The girl with the sneak is the ace of fucking cups. We're going to see in the minute what's under that deck. Spirit, clarify the cards for your daughter, please. Clarify the cards for me, please. What messages you want the Aquarius to have today? What messages would you like for the Aquarius to have? What's this called? Mm -hmm. Somebody is trying to build their courage. Somebody is tired. 
of the boundaries that you have set, Aquarius. Somebody has actually been preparing for the worst. Okay, I'm just going to tell you that. That's what Spirit said. What messages do you have for Aquarius, Spirit? What messages do you have for Aquarius? Wow. I hear preparing for the worst, child. Ooh, what messages do you have for Aquarius? This person is really feeling you gone. What's the absent with the Knight of Cups here? What's absent with the Knight of Cups? The Empress in the reverse. This person said you don't want the ass no more. Aquarius, this is somebody that you felt like you were the Empress already, but you was in the Emperor in the reverse with this person. It was like your creativity was blocked with them. This person had you leading toward being selfish towards others. I feel like this person had you being codependent as well in an aspect they wanted you to be. Okay, this person was trying to keep you in a lack of mindset or a lack of focus. You feel very indecisive with this person. I feel like this was somebody that you were fucking overwhelmed with this person brought you a lot of anxiety and i feel like there was some infidelity in your relationship with this person as feeling like you have absent and you have walked away from them aquarius okay i do not see this as a person that was keeping you in the energy that you needed to be. I feel like maybe this was a relationship where y'all had domestic issues or there was some type of insecurities. You probably felt stagnant with this person or you felt that there was going to be no progress in some type of relationship that y'all had. Child. What else with the same person spirit? Thank you. The strength. I'm telling you. So that means Aquarius that you... You prayed about it, you left left it where it was, and you allowed God to heal you is what I'm getting. Because with the strength here, you had your courage, okay? You had a passion to do what you needed to do for yourself. I feel like you guys picked up on your inner strength and you walked away from somebody, okay? You walked away from somebody to be compassionate towards yourself, Aquarius, because you wanted to be focused. You didn't want somebody that was going to have you in a lack mindset, okay? I feel like um, this person had you testing your own strength. Like, I feel like they had you in a point where you didn't know your own strength until it was actually tested with this foolishness that they had you going through, Aquarius. And I feel like now this is why this person is experiencing this. This person feels your absence so heavy. I'm hearing so heavy. Okay? What's, what's chemistry, spirit? What's chemistry in the five of cups? What's chemistry in the five of cups? That's right, telling you. You've got this King of Swords down here. So this is a system that, or issue, Aquarius, where you had to go in head over heart, okay? You felt like this is somebody that you had to stand up towards. You had to stand up to this person because this person um, was trying to take you for granted. That's the word they use, and taking you for granted. I feel like you were a very reliable source to somebody. You gave them good advice, or at least you tried to lead them down the right path, okay? This person wanted to have some type of mental, it's like they wanted to fuck with you, Aquarius, for no reason. I mean, no reason at all, because I'm picking up a sense of you trying to help somebody that was literally trying to do you dirty. Wow. I, I, I see that you tried to see this person in a, in a better light. But with this five of cups down here, this person had you in a state of mind where they, you felt lost. There could have been sadness around you or you were disappointed by something, even though you had chemistry with them. What's this chemistry with the five of cups and the chemistry? What else? What else? Thank you. I'm telling you, it made you, it made you go your separate ways. I felt like with the two of swords here, Aquarius, you had to make a decision. You had to make a decision. Some of y'all might have even left the home, okay? Some of y'all went towards obtaining goals that you were working on. Some of y'all went towards getting your happiness, okay? Some of y'all could have even had to plan or make progress to get away from this person because they wanted you to be so codependent upon them, Aquarius. This is why you got this unfinished business with this person here, okay? This person feels like you guys still need to resolve something because I don't think that this was somebody that was expecting you to walk away from their ass. 
Okay, what's this unfinished business with the hermit? Mm -hmm. The six of fucking, the six of cups. You can't make this shit up. The six of cups. Okay, what else? What's unfinished business with the hermit? So Aquarius, obviously this person is feeling your absence right now. This is somebody that you're familiar with or there's some familiarity here. Um, this is somebody that still holds happy, happy memory spirit is saying of you. This could have been somebody from childhood. This could have been somebody from just now or back in the day. Okay. But this person is feeling a lot of nostalgia. Okay. I feel. What, what else? What else? Yep. Because you're blocking them. This person tried to challenge you, Aquarius. This person trying to try to challenge you, but you were smart. You protected yourself. Okay, um, you were you you are still going to be. I feel like if this person even tried to come back, but this unfinished business shit, you're still going to be defensive so, towards them, and you are willing to stand up for yourself at all costs. Is what I'm hearing. Okay, this person is not going to like who they coming back to Aquarius. I feel like you've grown a lot. You've experienced a lot. Okay, what this person could play on you, this person is no longer able to play those type of games. Okay, because your inner wisdom and your guidance has definitely been heightened. Okay, but this person is still wanting to search for you. Okay, this person is still wanting to come back to see if anything is still if they could get anything going, somebody feels like you're no longer attracted to them, Aquarius. Okay. You no longer have the um for them, if I can say. You feel like um, this person feels like at one point you might have loved them a lot. Y'all had that good chemistry and shit like that, Aquarius, and you would go back. But I feel like right now, you're, this person is not the bliss that you wanted them to be. And so you're not wanting to re- you're not really wanting a reconciliation with whoever this is. And it's because they lie too fucking much. With the dishonesty right here, whatever they did, they know they ripped y'all apart. What's dishonesty with the four ones? The ace of swords, I'm telling you, right now, you're at a spot in your life, Aquarius, where you've gotten mental clarity. You've had a lot of successful breakthroughs. There are not a, a lot of new ideas that are coming to you. And right now you're so sharp in the mind. This person is not going to be able to play with you like that. Okay? You, you're you not, they're not going to be able to play with you like that. What, what, somebody feel like you out of their lead now. I'm telling you. Because you have the Ten of Pentacles. I mean the Ten of Cups, Aquarius. Somebody feels like you're out of their lead. I feel like this person sees you as somebody that's very attractive. They see you as somebody being different from a lot of other motherfuckers, Aquarius. They feel like with you, they can see divine harmony setting in, okay? This person can see your inner happiness. They can see you fulfilled within yourself, okay? And a lot of these people, they're so caught up into watching your dreams come true, and that's because... God has them watching what they thought that y'all wasn't able to be able to do. And y'all have been so content with y'all self. You're so fulfilled because the divine love is there. These people are seeing this white bright light that's exuding you. Your aura has been very much heightened and lightened. And these people are concerned about all the new blessings and the new beginnings that you have coming into your life. And that has already started pouring in towards you. Somebody wanted to be on a high horse and think they were better than you, Aquarius, okay? And this person, lo and behold, tried to de tried to be devious and shit like that. But at the same time, it only ripped them a new asshole. It only ripped them a new asshole. I feel like this is somebody that knows that they fucked up. This is somebody that's probably been waiting on you to contact them. And they most likely trying to act like this shit is not fucking bothering them. When in all honesty, Aquarius, all they have been doing from the time you walked away from them has been thinking about you. They've been seeing you live a comfortable life. They've been seeing you celebrate when the fuck you ready to. 
And with good honor of things happen, there's been success and blessings coming into your life. You have been, you've had a lot of stability to pour in exactly when you stop fucking with them. They're seeing that your divine connections are exactly, and you could have told this person that you were going towards your tribe, that you were going to look for people that wanted to be where you were in life. This person is seeing that clarity actually was given to you, Aquarius, okay? This is why they want to communicate something. What's this runner and this two of um, coins in the reverse? Because with the two of coins in the reverse, I feel like they ignored the signs where there was instability in your relationship. You were definitely, um, there was disharmony or they needed to slow down with the dumb shit that they was doing. And this made you run the fuck off. I'm telling you, with the two of pentacles in the reverse. It seems like this person was somebody that just didn't fucking listen. What's the runner in the two of queens? What's the runner in the two of queens, spirit? Right here. You, you avoiding them, Aquarius, right there. You're going to continue running. They, they got the eight of wands in the reverse. This person is receiving, they're getting very frustrated, Aquarius, because you've been holding out on them. You're, they're definitely waiting for you. I get a sense that somebody's been panicking. Somebody's also panicking, okay, because you're not reaching out. You're not giving them the reciprocity that they want. Somebody sees you as a missed opportunity with the Eight of Wands in the reverse here. This person could even be at a sense at a point where they're lacking energy themselves, okay? Um, they're, they're dealing with these frustrations alone. What's the runner? The Eight of Wands in the reverse with the Two of Pentacles in the reverse. Ooh. Bim, bim. The Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. I feel like this person hasn't been able to build their financial independence. Um, they are in conflict with a lot of things, even themselves. This is somebody that was very self-centered. With the Queen of Pentacles being in the reverse, this is somebody that was jealous. They could have even been at the point in their life where they've been trying to smother you, Aquarius. But this is somebody that's very dece um, deceitful. This is somebody that could be very devious as well. Um, this person could have definitely mistreated you. And I feel like you had a lot of suspicion about what was going on with them, Aquarius, okay? This person is still spying on you with the Page of Swords at the reverse, yeah. They're still curious about what's going on. It seems like more like they still want to be alerted about what's going on with you, Aquarius, okay? Or at least alerted as to what you got going on and what they could try to run back to. I'm telling you, let me see right here, okay? I feel like this is somebody that tried to charm you, Aquarius, okay, with the girl that's naked. This is somebody that tried to charm you, and they thought that they can get away with actually using you, but this person left themselves feeling broken. They left themselves feeling broken. They're definitely shattered about some type of situation that didn't work out for you. At the same time, this person is seeing you being the lighthearted individual that you need to be to yourself. This is definitely somebody that you're not speaking to anymore or something is strained between the two. Um, I feel like they're finding out that you've changed Aquarius, okay? Because things came to light for some of you guys, okay? I feel like with Q on the ring here, they're seeing you work with all these many options that you do have in your life. This person might even want to come back to have some type of one night stand, but this person might still be in the aspect of where they want to string you along, Aquarius. Um, this person knows that their life is just unconventional and look at the reciprocity coming right back up. This person still wants some type of equal give and take with you, but I believe that you're watching people that are coming towards you. This person um, with the sunglasses here, this person is definitely still um, stalking you or looking up what you're doing. They're trying to figure you out. They're watching, okay? They're seeing that your ships are coming through, Aquarius. You cannot make these shit up, okay? This person, you cut ties with them and you moved on. But I feel like you've been receiving what you need ever since. Like there have been some type of progression in your life. Things have been arriving. 
okay this was some type of partnership that didn't work due to some type of addiction it could have been um, and that could have been a codependency cool this person could have been obsessed or they could try to restrain you in some way they could have also been controlling addiction or this just could have been emotionally blocking but also trying to emotionally block you okay this person feels like you guys were two people that were inseparable okay like your love was always going to stand the test of time despite the distance but somebody wants to wants forgiveness from you somebody feels like you're moving on and how you know that squares because they got the ace of cups to the bottom somebody's seeing you stand up for yourself and make moves Aquarius okay they are wanting to come back into your life because in a space you you good you fucking good when I say you good you good you got the ace of cups and the ace of wands they seeing that you could be um, moving towards creativity in your life where businesses are flourishing you've got a new job offer things are starting to come through to you but you're healed Aquarius there's a lot of emotional stability with you right now um, you're very passionate about what you're doing with the ace of wands here you're definitely always going to be inspired by yourself okay and manifestations are definitely coming through you just feel like you was done with this person with the world here Aquarius there's something that you feel like this is a complete for you okay this person couldn't make you feel fulfilled when you was with them I just feel like that's a door that you're not going to toggle back through you've made a lot of choices in your life with the two of wands here okay those choices came with you setting goals and taking action for your motherfucking self you are sick and tired and you're not playing with pages no more these people trying to come back to y'all what being in page accent this is still they probably still insecure about a couple of things in their life they even could have been childish at one point okay or was afraid to even trust okay but they wanting to come back and try to offer they were hoping that there's still something that they could get with you okay or at least that you'll cooperate with them aquarius i feel like they in for a rude awakening with the moon here they in for some type of rude awakening. I don't feel like this is somebody that you're going to be running back to open arms about. You knew that this person was very delusional. They was very fake, very phony. They was keeping secrets. Your intuition was heightening you. This person was trying to act like they was fucking mysterious when it came down to things. You're not for that no more. I feel like somebody acts or is going to act like they want to apologize to you Aquarius but they're not going to mean what the fuck they see and I feel like you're definitely going to catch on to that because it seems like this could have been an embarrassing moment this person could have actually embarrassed you with all the dumb shit that they had going on inside their life so this is why I feel like this is not somebody that you're going to take back this person seemed like they was very impatient and you lost focus when you was around them this person was so unpredictable which wasn't good for you with the three of fucking um, coins here I'm telling you right now somebody's hoping that there's gonna be some type of teamwork that they can come back to or they could use Aquarius and it's because they see the wheel moving in your fucking favor things have been happening for you okay They've been happening for you, not to you. You understand what I'm saying? So anytime people see that shit is going in your favor, they always want to get back in your good graces to see what part of it that they can attach themselves to. And this is why I always tell y'all, y'all got to be real careful about what people want from y'all. Because people will come in acting like they want one thing, Aquarius, but at the end of the day, these people know good and well. They want to be attached to your good luck. They want to have good karma. They're hoping that destiny will change in their favor. Okay? With the Eight of Wands say, like I said, Aquarius, somebody is definitely wanting to take some type of action. I feel like this person also feels excited that they're going to try to take to get back with you. But I feel like there's still going to be setbacks when it comes down to you because you're not going to be just as nice as you used to be to somebody is what I'm getting, Aquarius okay I feel like the success that you've had in your life and the self-confidence that you guys got now you're not looking to be in those situations 
where you feel like shit is not working for you no more. You're worrying about what the fuck a motherfucker doing or you suffering because you still dealing with somebody. Okay. I don't feel that as you. I feel like you're going to step up for yourself like you should Aquarius. You going to let these people know that they cannot play with you. Playing with you is not the name of the game. Okay. You're going to be very objective when it comes down to people. You're going to use your intelligence. And if they can't communicate with you, then they can get the fuck on. I'm hearing kick rocks. Okay. What I'm saying to you, Aquarius, things have came into your life. And the harmony and the love that you got around you right now, people want to connect to this, to you for certain reasons. I'm telling you, don't allow people to keep y'all down when they didn't want to stay around in the first place. I feel like they probably been exp or trying to explain to other people why you and why you're not fucking with them no more queries. But I feel like this is something that people saw coming. People saw this shit coming. This person has been struggling with trying to get over the past when it comes down to you, Aquarius. I'm telling you, they're not dealing with the separation the way that they should or this relationship being over. They're hoping that there's going to be some type of change, okay? They might even be trying to get others to come in and support them, okay? But I feel like this person was so selfish in the end. You're just not going to go back to what was not working for you before. I feel like you've grown a lot. Okay, you've definitely grown and you've built yourself up. Okay, you're gonna stay to yourself the way you've been when it comes down to this person. I just that's how I feel, Aquarius. Okay, this person was too negative for you, is what I'm getting. And like, this person could have even been abusive, like, they could have been abusive to you as well, Aquarius, is what I'm picking up. And this is why this person is wanting to come back. Yes, you're absent in their life, and they definitely is fucking feeling it. All right, Aquarius, do your girl a favor. Thumbs up the video. Share, share, share. And make sure y'all turn on those notification bells. I love you, booze. Thanks for watching.